Hey, what's up everybody out there in YouTube land? Eric Ferris, Editor-in-Chief here at the Motherboards.org YouTube channel. Well, every so often we request for videos, and then sometimes we get a chance to actually do those videos. One of our viewers, Randy Lockheed, requested that we do a video asking why one would buy at a laptop or a desktop. I guess his brother bought a laptop that costs much more than his desktop, and so he's kind of confused about why he would, would do this. Well, there's only really one reason why you would ever buy a laptop over a desktop. And that is portability. If you're someone who is on the go, travels a lot, and needs something that they can use in a bunch of different locations, that is why you would buy a laptop. If you're someone who never moves whatsoever and is going to have a computer in one place at all times, you definitely want to only buy a desktop. There's no reason to have a laptop in this type of instance. The reasons are this. Laptops, in a way, are kind of a luxury item. Even though they're used for business and for a lot of other congenial things, having one is kind of a big item. So you're paying a lot more to stuff all these parts into this little portable unit. When you buy a desktop, you get a lot more bang for your buck because you can actually mix out all the components, custom choose what you want, and configure a desktop system to actually custom meet your needs. Laptops still aren't at this way. With a laptop, you get what's in the box, and that's really about it. There are some companies that have taken initiative to make a few you know, minor adjustments on a laptop here and there, including like the Toughbook one that we actually smacked around and dumped water on. That was pretty cool, by the way. you got to give that, you know. But that's really, you know, what it is. So if you're a person who is strictly going to be in one place all the time, you want to buy a desktop because the price versus performance ratio is always going to be better on a desktop. Now, if you're going to be traveling, you need something on more than one location, then a laptop would be your best benefit. When you're buying either one of these things, though, you always want to kind of stick to things that are right down the middle. In the PC world, the top-end stuff is usually pricey. The bottom-end stuff is always outdated. The road right down the middle is always the best value and best bang for your buck. I hope this helps. Thanks a lot for requesting the video, Randy, and uh, we hope to see all of you here on the YouTube channel.